Our next two examples will involve integration by parts on a more conceptual level. Uh, these are the types that you can't just go to Wolfram Alpha and type it in and get an answer. So here's one example. Uh, we're getting a table of values. And given that f is a twice differentiable function, and are to calculate this definite interval. So you'll see that it's x times f double prime of x. So that's a good candidate for parts because it's a product. I'll let u be x because that's the part that's going to differentiate down to nothing. And that means dv has to be the rest of it which would make dv f double prime of x dx. So du is dx. Uh, for the dv, we integrate to get v. And if you integrate f double prime, it just finds the antiderivative, which would just be f prime. So now we use the parts formula this integral is equal to uv minus the integral of v du so we still have to integrate uh, but now we have the integral of f prime so the integral of f prime is f of x plus c. We're not going to use the plus c because it's a definite integral. So we're just going to evaluate this function from 0 to 1. So as always, you plug in 1. So we have 1 times f prime of 1 minus f of 1, and subtract what you get when you plug in 0. So it would be 0 minus f of 0. And now you refer to the table. That should give you all the information you need. So I'm going to bring it down for us. So f of one, f of is it f prime, f prime of one is six. F of one, according to the table, is two. F of zero is one. So it's six minus two minus negative one, or five. So that's that. Uh, the next example we're going to do in the next video, just for time purposes, and it's going to look like this. So take a look at that one.